Hello friends. Today I'm going to show you this TP-Link 4G LT wireless router. This router helps for you if you don't have a broadband connection nearby or cable connections. It is a very easy setup router which makes your 4G connection directly to a Wi-Fi router. Let me open it up. Let me skip this part of opening this box. And uh, here we have Here we have the router, which is basically sealed. We have the TP Link router. As you can see here, there is a power port. This is a power switch on and on button. There are four LAN connections. This LAN can be used as a LAN 4 point or can be used from a broadband input link there is a reset button wi-fi on off and the tray for your sim card and two antennas Let me keep this aside here are the two antennas as you can see here here are the two antennas that we have and uh, there are some technical support SIM slots like for micro and uh, nano SIM adapters, uh, some more quick installation guide. We have a small cable, uh, power input, power input. That's it. Let me set it up and uh, I will show you how we will be setting it up directly on the PC. I have connected my um, rotor to the PC. You can check it here on the back side. And uh, now I am going to power it up using the button uh, that was given in the band. Okay, let me switch it on. Yes, it is on. It takes a few minutes to boot up. So let me skip this part. As you can see here, it is connected with my PC and uh, here all LEDs are glowing up and it is giving only one signal of LTE network. I don't know why. We set up the signals. Yeah, it is going three bars. I think uh, it has out of uh, four bars, I'm getting three bars. That means it is a very good signal. Let us uh, switch on to the Internet Explorer and we will punch in the port number that is by default for every connection let me punch it and log in the interface is very nice it is asking me to input my new password and all let me complete this and we will switch to the next step this is the first screen in the screen you will be asked for the setting up of general services like the time date and location and everything and you have to register your device let me go through this and we will be talking about how to set up the sim card and its settings i have set up and you can see the interface is very useful very easy and uh, you can map your network here like uh, which are the clients you want to move, move it in the primary and secondary and everything that dual this is a dual band Wi-Fi that is a 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz simultaneously so you will be getting around high speeds in all the connections and uh, the modem uh, this uh, uh, router has it can go up to 150 Mbps on 4G connections and it supports 3G and 2G also so you can also connect here uh, your guest networks like you can allow for some of your friends and everything there come up to visit your home or something 
there are some parental controls like you can control some specific devices to dot to connect this network and also you can uh, control when the websites that you don't want to be logged in by your children or anything now you can see the status it is 3g 4g and the mac id and everything since i have not uh, set up my internet right now so it is not showing the ip address and everything here you can check your operating mode, network, SMS, wireless, guest network, net forwarding. For gaming, you need net forwarding, okay? So these are all uh, essential setups and very easy. You can see uh, the interface is very nice and cool. That's all guys. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.